It's coming up in just a moment. And famous people are going to be here from the movies. More often, simply discourteous and annoying. 1065 K Whale. It's 9, 10. It's the Bob March Show. Thanks for listening. It is the uh, 19th of May. 47 on its way to 64. By Friday, 70. All right? It's going to be a lovely, lovely... By uh, Saturday, lovely yep. the earth shall be scorched. Oh, yeah. It'll be like 900 degrees on Monday <laughs> if the Holocaust should happen. Mm -hmm. All right, so I'm excited. Uh, there's been a lot of more action in the movie-making genre for Alaska. I think the legislature helped in passing all these new... Uh, giveaways or, or incentives to get people to come up here and uh, film their movies. Because you know what it sucks is when you watch a movie and it's supposed to be in Alaska and you know it was like filmed in Connecticut or Norway or yeah. whatever. You know, as Alaskans, we pick up on that. You know, most of the country, they don't they don't know the difference. They say no, snow, no, no. they think, ah, I must be no, Alaska. No, there was a great one. There was um, a Jackie Chan movie, Rumble in the Bronx, mm -hmm. where it took place in New York City, but they used Vancouver, B.C. as right. the there's no mountains in New York City. Of course. So they had the sky skyline with mountains behind it. Right. Well, remember, Northern what Exposure was filmed in Roslyn, Washington, for right. God's sakes. Well, uh, Justin Baird, he's a, a director. Let me ask you, Justin, this movie, uh, it's called Coldwood. Yeah. And you've already started filming. Production yeah. has, has begun. And they're filming it not only in Alaska, but within, what, a 45-mile uh, perimeter of Anchorage? Yeah, mostly around Eagle River and Chugiak. Right. And now... Was this, I mean, the film is about Clive, uh, who's played by Les Mahoney, who is a, a ghost detective, if you will. He, is, that, is that correct? Yeah, he's a, he's a ghost detective, but he's a, more than anything, he's a con man. Right, exactly. And he's kind of an a-hole, um, from, from what I gather. <laughs> kind of. Right, he steals money off of tips, off of tables, and he's just that kind of guy. So he kind of comes into Alaska to try and see what he can get from the town before he splits. Um, now... Carly uh, Jones plays the part of Ashley. You're his mm -hmm. hot niece, right? <laughs> I, I, I right? guess so, yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> all right. Uh, are you from L.A.? I am. Okay. Is this your first time to Alaska? It is. What do you think? Uh, it's like everything is in HD. Yeah. It's just clear, crystal clear. Now, when you first came up here, did you cough a lot because of all this fresh air getting into your lungs? <laughs> I, I yawned yeah. a lot. It was like my, my brain needed the oxygen. Yeah. Isn't it? It's awesome, isn't it? Yes, it's amazing. And you're, Incredible. Fly, you're, and you're leaving tonight? Tonight. Back to L.A.? 1.55 in the morning. Wow. So sad. I so, don't want to leave. Well, you don't, you don't have to. You can I stay. don't want to. <laughs> now, are you done? Is all your filming done? No, we have a full day ahead of us. So as soon as we're done here, we're heading back to set. Oh, okay. Very good. And where, yeah. is, where is set today? Today it's at the Heritage Center. Um, yeah. In, where is it? Yeah. Well, oh, the last Native Heritage Center. Yeah, yeah. Oh, very good. Now, and Savannah Wiltfong, we already know her. That's right. Because she was in, a, in another movie uh, that, that played here, and it was really good, and it got awards and all that stuff. You were playing Simone. Yes. Now, what is your, who is your character in this movie? My character is a local girl who actually meets Ashley and befriends her and saves her from falling in the snow because she's wearing these tiny little slippers and... <laughs> I'm just like, what are you doing? Right. It's, it's like you're the Alaskan that you would never think of doing stuff like that. And, and, yeah. Okay. Um, is this something that we can expect more of, do you think, where, uh, you know, movies will start being shot here just simply because, my God, I mean, you, you can go an hour and be in the most beautiful, pristine wilderness. You just can't pay for that no. kind of experience. I, I think, yeah. I uh, actually, since we've been here, I've seen, um, I've met people who have already said that there are other productions coming, so I think you can definitely expect more of it. And, and is, way, does, yeah. does part of it have to do with the way that we have enticed uh, these companies to come in? That obviously helps. I think that definitely helps. That's right. definitely one thing because uh, things in L.A. are becoming so expensive, but, um, but also just like you said, it's absolutely gorgeous, right. stunning, it's amazing. And I understand this movie... You've used a lot of Alaskans uh, in the, in like for the extras, and I got a little part, which is really really cool. I'm excited to be you and I get to get to uh, play a little part because I'm trying to hit on your 
your your niece. <laughs> how, 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 how old was her character in this film? You're 25. Yeah. Oh, all right, yeah. all right. So I'm not that big. Of no, a no, 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 no. Right. You're in the clear on this one. <laughs> That's right. Now, I, I handed right. you. I handed you. You want to do a couple of our lines real yes, quick? Let's 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 pretend we're we're doing our we're doing our scene. All right. So I got to set the scene. Um, this is the first time I meet you. And I'm I'm kind of jovial. I'm, I'm, well, you be the director. You tell me. You set the scene of, of kind of what's happening here. All right. Well, pull that mic. Pull the mic up a little bit. There you go. Yeah. So essentially, you're going to be, um, you know, talking to this guy. You're gonna. You, you've heard about his niece. You're gonna go up, and you're gonna try to say, hey, I need permission to to hit on her. Essentially. And he's just not going to give you the time of day. He, he just doesn't really care about you. Exactly. He, so. he thinks I'm a, I'm a doofus, a reject, a loser, which I might be, but I'm, you know, I still think I'm a pretty good guy. Well, yeah, you should. All right, so here's, here's our scene. All right. We're in the bar, yep. right? There's, there's other people milling around the bar, and I'm just kind of walking by or whatever, and I see you sitting there. All right, here we go. Hey, hey aren't you that ghost hunter guy? I don't know what you're talking no, about. No, 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 no. I... I've heard about you. You're up here trying to scare away ghosts. Hmm. Uh, you figured me out. Quite the rocket scientist. <laughs> Who are you going to call? <laughs> oh, uh, Ghostbusters. Yeah, that's very creative. I've, I haven't heard that one before today. You know, you think you're pretty smart, don't you? Only relative to the company I keep. Well, hey, hey who's that, who that lady you were here with? Is, uh, is that your girlfriend? Actually, no. She's my niece. I, I like to watch out for her. Why? Uh, you know, I, I was thinking I, I might like to show her around, you know, let her experience a little local flavor of the area, you know? Well, tell me about yourself. I don't let her go out with just anyone. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a good guy. I'm a hard working. I, I know how to treat a lady. You know, I, I appreciate them for who they are. <laughs> well, let me tell you about women. They're complicated and slightly crazy. Let me put it in a way you'd understand. Women are kind of like Rubik's Cube. They're confusing, twisted. And often contain 8 to 12 ounces of synthetic material. So, um, do you, you, you think I can see her? Yeah. I don't see that happening. You're a douche. <laughs> <laughs> that's 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 I don't say that part. That's an ad lib. All right, well done. Well done. I felt it. I felt it. All right. So, uh, when will you be wrapping up? Uh, filming for this movie. We wrap up, we do our last shot, which is a helicopter aerial shot of Alaska with the car driving away for, uh, I think, on the 25th or no, right. 20, 25th to 6th. Now, is there going to be any more need for extras uh, where, you know, someone listens and say, man, I'd love to, to be in a, in a movie and just be a part of the process. Do you think that might happen? Yeah, I think there are certain days we need extras. So, yeah, if um, you can contact us. And now, best book, now, Facebook, uh, I know that the Coldwood has its own Facebook page. Yeah. So the best thing to do is become a fan of that. And Wendy, I know, Savannah's mother, will yeah. post, hey, we need 35 people at this yeah. spot between this time. Come and be a part of the process. And it's kind of cool. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, it's a, a great way to learn how to how it goes. How yeah, it yeah, yeah. It's yeah. fun. And, and you know what? Thank you for, for coming up here. Thank so you. now the big question is, when it's all done, um, will we be able to see this movie? Well, we're hoping to get into the Anchorage International Film Festival. Okay. So if that happens, then absolutely. Um, otherwise, I think, you know, we'd love to come up and do like a showing. Sure. You know, if anyone to see, wants to see it. I mean, the more people, the merrier. We want, we well, want here, here's this. what I said. You know, get like 5,000 extras, you know. <laughs> and we're guaranteed to pack a place. Uh, you I know? like your thinking. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, so you, hey, you can Five see me for two seconds. Oh, that's me. <laughs> well, thank you all. Thank you all for coming in here. It's, uh, it's very good. It's Coldwood. Go to Facebook and become a... Uh, a like or a fan or whatever exactly. and you might be able to be in in the movie and, and best of luck to you have fun filming today we'll see you on saturday absolutely uh, you and me clive we're gonna go at it we're and going at it. savannah it's always a pleasure to see you all just right, a rock star guys. all right thank, thank you, you and thank you very much uh for being in justin we'll take a break it's a bob mark show we've got more afc tickets coming up we'll give them away next hang on everybody